Okay, so just getting right into it, Aries. Already got some of your cards already shuffled out. We're going to do the rest, so don't, don't freak out over here. We have the Three of Pentacles, the Four of Swords, the Chariot card. This is Cancer Energy, the High Priestess, Pisces Energy, we have the Queen of Swords, Air Energy, Knight of Cups, Ace of Pentacles, Nine of Cups, just ignore my hair, the Ten of Swords. Aries, I feel like you help heal people, you help make them happy, you help bring them out of this energy of feeling hurt, um, and you move them into this energy of feeling more happier and more free, like a your healer here. You work with others, you heal them. Particularly to do with love, you know, with love situations. Okay. So let's see more. Now keep in mind that this will not resonate for all of you, so if it's not resonating, just leave it. Okay. We have number 31 with truth and number 35 with illusion. So Aries, another thing you do here is you help people see the truth in their situation. You break through this illusion here on exactly what's really going on in their life, their love life, whatever is going on. You help them see that and you help them move forward and heal from it. Okay, now, let me just look at something. How intuitive of a person you have you are here some of you you do this as like a light worker through tarot whatever you do this in some sort of way but you are a highly intuitive person here you're very connected we have the crone and the pilgrim so it feels like you're the you're one of a kind here you're the only one that's really doing this you're the only one that's helping them see these truths and help them get out of situations that aren't really meant for them Number 29, let's see the bigger picture. You help them see the full picture of here of what's fully going on in their life. Ooh. I've not seen this card pop out in a while, so we're going to have to read about it. And number one with Bamboo Moon, so, okay, it's over here. Did you know that there are no mistakes in the universe and all events, circumstances, relationships, and situations are unfolding in perfection with the divine, with the timing? An intelligence of the divine plan. Any apparent delay is in your favor. If something is happening for you right now, then that is perfect too. Divine timing is perfection. It is safe to trust us now. That is a message for you. Um, so Aries, that's for you. If things are working for you, then that's great. If things are not happening for you, then you know, it's going to happen when it's meant to. Don't try to force things. And I feel like you help people with that as well because that's something you've dealt with. I've got so many cards all over the place. It's such a mess. Ooh. 
yeah. You have number six of contract. This is something you're meant to do. This is something your soul is tied to. You have this contract as a, a healer, healer of the ages. You are that healing person, Aries, whether you admit that or not. And it feels like a very powerful energy to you. Um, you help heal them. It feels like you help, like I've been saying throughout this entire reading, you help break them out of things that are not meant for them, things they are stuck in. You help move them out of that, feeling more happier. And that is something you're meant to do here. Number 24, we're love where you are. Use your sensitivity to know when to act. Connect your heart to your head when determining what you would like. Okay. Um, some of you may have, like, rejected this before, like, rejected this, um, what you're meant to do, and it's telling you to kind of, like, accept it. And that's not for all of you, but I feel like some of you have kind of been like, no, I'm not meant for that, or no, I'm meant to do different things. Number 35, Mandela of the Moon. So this card talks about is things are working up for you, things are manifesting, and I, I really feel like there's a powerful energy to you. Like you, you, you have a sort of manifesting, healing energy, intuitive. So Aries, even when things feel like they're stuck, it's not going anywhere, it is working out for you. That's just a message. You keep having cards wanting to fly out, but it's too many. Number 43, Father of the Sky, God, I release the weight of the world from my shoulders. Look at, look at this energy. I love this. You have... Ooh. Number 39, the medicine woman, heal. I nurture and I nurture and nourish my mind, body, and soul. There's that healing energy once again. Number two, beloved Zeus, Zeus, lovers. This cosmic union is destined for greatness. Number 16, the morning star, radiance. I shoot for the star. Radiance is my birthright. Oh yes, this is something you're meant to do. You're meant to really go for this meant to accomplish things as you're doing this as well okay so I believe that is all I have for you Aries because it's just gonna be the same thing coming out over and over again and um, I will see you later